Hey guys, so just wanted to make a quick update video. Do I have taco sauce on my lips? If I do, don't judge me. I like tacos. Anyways, um, so yesterday was my cardiologist appointment and I was going to the cardiologist for my peace of mind. And unfortunately that is not what ended up happening. So I get to the cardiologist and he reviews um, my EKG that I had had at um, an ER like a month ago, which was abnormal. And then he does a repeat EK EKG. And yesterday that one was also abnormal. Yeah. So, you know, I'm kind of like asking the doctor, like, what does that mean? And for someone with anxiety, I mean, it's just, it's not what I wanted to hear, like at all. And he was like, well, it could be nothing at all. It could be that's just the way your heart is. That's just normal for you. Um, or it could mean something as much as like a completely blocked artery. What? So that was not what I wanted to hear. Um, and emotionally I'm really struggling with it. And, um, I don't know. I'm just feeling a lot right now. The, the next plan of action is he's got to get... Uh, he's got to run it through my health insurance, but he's he's got to see if they'll approve it. I'm sure hopefully they will or else they'll be getting a call from me. But um, my insurance is going to have to approve uh, an echocardiogram, like a, an ultrasound on my heart. And also I have to do a stress test with the treadmill. Like I'm 27 and I'm just pretty pissed that I'm going through this right now because... I've got kids and a life and it just sucks when you have health issues, physical, mental, either, either one, it just, it sucks. And so I just wanted to give a quick update about that. Um, I've had a panic attack today because I have for some reason, some really bad pain in like my shoulder on my left side. That's like going through my back, kind of into my chest. And I don't know what that is, but since I just got this news yesterday, I'm, you know, like, ugh, is this a heart attack? So, yeah, I have this really weird habit that I do. I wonder if any of you guys do this, but when I'm having, like, anxiety, I always check the color of my fingernails to see if they're blue or if they're, like, pink like they should be. Um, yeah, embarrassing, but I do that. So I've been just like looking at my fingernails all day to make sure they're not like turning blue or gray or yeah. Um, and so yeah, that's just a quick update. Did not hear what I wanted to hear at the cardiologist. Um, and I do not mean to like scare anybody, of course. Um, I'm sure like in my case, it's rare because most people who have, who struggle with anxiety and panic attacks, they go to, you know, like an ER, they get an EKG done and like it's normal. And if you're one of those people, just count your blessings that it's normal and it's okay. Um, I'm just really stressed out now about this. So, um, yeah. And this just goes to show too, like, I get that it sucks. Like having, you know, the anxiety that we do and being so just hyper aware of everything in your body. But it's, it's a good thing too, at the same time, because I, even though I've been struggling with this anxiety for, you know, really bad over the last six months, I think also a part of me was trying, like my body was trying to tell me that something was off. And so if that's the case, then maybe I caught it early enough to where, you know, we can just, you know, we can handle it. But yeah, um, yeah, right now sucks because I have immense pain shooting through my shoulders right now. My left shoulder, to be exact. And uh, going up into my neck and everything, and all I can think about is heart. And I'm sure anyone with health anxiety has one of these. But um, yeah, this is my blood pressure cuff. And I took it. It was uh, 111 over 74. My heart rate was like 73. So those are good numbers. Um... But then again, I don't know what those numbers would look like 
during a heart attack. As you can tell, I'm just really anxiety ridden today over my heart. Um, I'm about to take my Boosperone, which always seems to help with that for the most part, <clears throat> those racing thoughts and stuff. And hopefully this pain isn't heart related that I'm feeling. I don't know what it would be though. It just like suddenly came on like two hours ago and yeah, some weird sensations that I'm feeling right now. But, uh, yep, just an update. And, you know, if if you are ever feeling, like, just super just off and, you know, I mean, listen to your bodies. You know, I, people, you know, even my coworkers and certain friends and, you know, people in my life wanted to tell me that, like, a lot of this is all in my head. And I started to believe them at one point. And I'm just really glad that I listened to my body I was in tune with my body enough to listen to it to go get checked out. If anything, for the peace of mind. But in my case, like, I may have just found something that could have potentially hurt me, you know, later in life. Um, and hopefully now that we're aware of it, we can avoid it. So, listen to your bodies, you know. Listen to your bodies. But I hope everyone uh, has a good weekend. I'll update um, with another video whenever I can, and happy Friday to everybody. <laughs>